Hey, it's Lost Turtle here. Today I'm out with, uh, you know it, the Muscle Russell. We are in Baltic, Connecticut at the Baltic Cotton Mill. And we came off the trail and we found this. this the old race head to the, provide, that provided power to the cotton mill. And uh, this was up and it was holding back water until August 8th, 1959 when uh, Hurricane Diane came through and knocked her out of commission and since the mill wasn't using power from this anymore they never bothered to rebuild it so let's check it out see in a few check out this stonework it's amazing these are the most recent addition in uh 1885 they built this the power the addition that they had the um die and weave building they put these one these uh tunnels with the arches on them and over here behind all this shrubbery you have the originals these square shaped ones that are power that provided the power for the original portion of the mill now if this were in operation right now, I'd be standing in about six feet of water, which is over my head. So I would be completely underwater. But this is amazing. You know how you got the moss and the ferns growing out of it? The ivy growing up the wall? I'm gonna go through here. Help me, I found a tunnel. Check it out. Got this old piece of wood. You can see the screw hole in it. You can just kind of see the remnants of the tread. There's some iron right there. Barrel down there and it's in cans. <laughs> Them guardrail poles, and then we're up and through. Oh, look at this! This is amazing. Look at that architecture. That big central rock. Hardly any mortar in there. That is just amazing. And when you come out of the tunnel, you got this, the old flag waving in the breeze. And you have this piece of granite that they used to build the mill. So now let's go check out the mill. We come to the mill. I gotta walk precariously along that edge to get down there. We're gonna show you a little bit. Look at this. Look at this. And we got the. Uh, I can't really see it. Water over there. So we're gonna go down there and check it out. Muscle's already down there. So let's go. Oh, we made it inside the mill. Look at this. Get the muscle rustle over there. Get at this is the turbine. This is the turbine for the race head. This is where they got the power. I gotta walk across that thing. Wish me luck. So I'll see you when I get across. So this is the generator. We showed you the race head where they control the water. You can see if you come over here. You got the um, 
blade right there where the water will come through the turbine. Then it will exit out through this tube right here. And then this giant shaft would spin this giant wheel. You can see right here all the grooves for the belt. So then it would turn. Then it would cause, you can't see what's underneath, but then it would come up and spin here where they would have a copper coils and they spin them around and it would generate the electricity. But if you look at this, talk about local trade, this engine is a Rodney Hewn machine company out of Orange, Massachusetts. Muscle's been telling me that he's been wanting to come here for a while. But he was afraid to come alone. And I was like, the Muscle's afraid to come alone? It don't really make sense. Muscle ain't afraid of nothing. But now when I look at the floorboards, I can see why this is definitely a team explorer. They're totally rotted out. And there ain't no handrails. I decided to stop and show you this. This is beautiful. See how the arc is reflecting in the water, making a circle. And that beam bisects it. And you got these old windows up here. Whew, dangerous it is. It sure is beautiful. Hey, look at that pipe. Maybe I could come out here with Hobie Cat. Check that out. Yeah, so check out Hobie Cat stuff. It's a uh, Hobie Cat at, well, at Hobie Cat. So check them out. Oh, there's granite and brick and piping. Oh, imagine what this looked like back in its heyday. Well, that was part one of the Baltic cotton mill. We got to this rubble that we're about to get over. So uh, I'll, this is where I'll start off part two. So, you know, signing off, me and the muscle rustle. And uh, you know the routine. There's a lot of old mills out there. So get out there and explore everything. See you next time, hope you enjoyed.